chef Thomas Keller always brings us great recipes and cooking tips. For the holidays, he's put together two of his best cookbooks, The French Laundry and Ad Hoc at Home, in a box gift set called The Essential Thomas Keller. Something for you to think about <laughs> as you uh, head to the mall later today. On the menu today, though, an easy, tasty holiday brunch. Great to right. see you. Good to see you. Harry. Always a pleasure. Oh, no, I'm back. All right, we're going to poach some eggs. To uh, we're going to poach an egg. I think some, there's a couple things that are that are critical poaching a really beautiful egg. Mm -hmm. Number one, make sure the eggs are tempered so they're not re ice cold. Okay. Number two, have have a tall pot. <laughs> Full of water. Sure. Number three, of course, we've got some vinegar that's going to help us. I was going to say, what yeah. do you put in the yeah. water to just make vinegar. sure? Just no, wet, don't just put any salt in there. All right. Okay. The vinegar is going to help set the albumin mm -hmm. in the egg. All right. Third, we want to get this thing spinning. We want to get the water spinning. Really? Yeah. And then you can go ahead and just drop the eggs in there. Okay. And this, of course, these eggs yep. are room temp. Yeah. Oh, get a little closer. There you go. Right down. Okay, there you go. I'll and as it's it. spinning, it's going to pull that albumin towards the yolk. So it's going to keep that, that white against the yolk. Okay? I, this is and as about, much fun as you can have. In about three minutes, we have a perfectly poached egg. We also want to have it just at a very low simmer so that the, the water is pushing So it's not bubbling out. like crazy. Right. You, don't want, you don't want it to be too active, okay? I'm so we're going to let those go. I'm transfixed by this. Yeah. It's cool, huh? That is very <laughs> cool to watch. In the okay. meantime, we're going to make some, some buttermilk biscuits. Oh, I love this. We want to start putting our, we have two kinds of flours here. Right. We have all-purpose flour, mm -hmm. and we have cake flour. The cake flour is going to make it a little lighter. Oh, okay? okay. We have baking soda, mm -hmm. baking powder, all right. and salt. And basically, That's we're going to add easy, some butter. Right? Yeah, very simple. Yeah. And the buttermilk pancakes, these are buttermilk biscuits. Are just all of this yeah, butter, all that butter, yeah, all that, all that stuff. butter. Yeah. <laughs> what we want to do is just get it to pulse, so we can break it up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Break those pieces of butter up. Sure. And it's going to be like this. All what right. we end up with, okay? Got it. We don't want to do it. We don't want to do it until it comes together because it gets really tough. All right. We're going to add our buttermilk. All right. Okay. And you just Should I? mix it together. All right. Yeah. Very simple. You can do, uh, certainly do these ahead of time, mm -hmm. and, and that, one thing I want to say is they freeze really well. Oh, I'll bet. Then you just take them out and pop them in your Can oven. I also say, you know, we're talking about a holiday brunch. Everybody worries so much about the, the big meals. Yes. Sometimes as people get up in the morning, and oh, if they actually right. get a meal made like this, it's such a reward, it's such a great it's, time to share. It's a splendid way to begin the day. Yep, and no question. Right. All right. Now we're just going to turn that out onto the board here. And again, it doesn't look like <coughs> it's all together. I'm right. Gonna bring it together just a little bit. Okay. Almost like pasta, if you will. This is the part that would scare me. Oh, no. It's no? Not scary at all. This is not scary. I'm going to be afraid to knead it too much mm -hmm. and, you know, whatever else. Mm -hmm. But there's no, there's no, there's no rising qualities. Well, you had it in the cake flour, I guess. Right, in the cake there's flour. There's the stuff in it you that you powder, need to make you it got rise. The, you got the baking soda. Uh-huh. So we're just going to let, let it go out there. Yeah. Flatten it out. Yep. And we're going to cut it. Just as simple as that. Just as simple as that. Right. And brush it with some buttermilk. Buttermilk. And then we're going to bake those. Buttermilk on top of the buttermilk. Buttermilk on top of the buttermilk. Right. Now we're going to take our eggs out here. Mm -hmm. Look at these guys mm -hmm. now. Do you mind? Not at all. Do I dare? Go ahead. Now what I want to do is I want to trim it. Pull it out. Yeah. And it's going to trim that off. Okay? Look at that. And then drop that egg on your buttermilk biscuit there. Oh my gosh. See how beautiful it is? I don't want to. No, you got it. Perfect. A little bit of salt, <laughs> a little bit of pepper. Mm -hmm. I, got, I got biscuits all over my hands. Yeah, but that's now what, what happens. Now what else here? Now what? what is We've this got right? some raspberry. Uh, some. I'm sorry. Some plum Zinfandel jam. And would you would just be making well, plum I've got jam it right and there on the biscuit, right? A and toasted then biscuit. and throw a little Zinfandel in mm -hmm. with the. With well, the we reduce the Zinfandel. Mm -hmm. we, then we peel the, the. We we cut the pits out of the plums. Right. And go ahead and cook that down. Right. And there we go. Look at that bad boy right there. Oh man, do you, do you mind? Oh, you, you should go. I gotta go for it. Go for it. Well, you mm -hmm. can pick it up if you want to. Yeah, I think this is gonna be easier. But you can to use a knife this. and fork. Yeah, uh, maybe a knife. You're and right. Fork. You're so right. right. Yeah, I think you're absolutely correct. <laughs> what was I thinking? There you go. See, three, three and a half minutes. Mm -hmm. You've got a perfectly poached egg. Right. And imagine. Now you can do these ahead of time. Take them out, cool, shock them in ice water, and then reheat them. In, in, in just simmering water as well for about 30, 30, 45, 30 to 45 seconds and, and then come right back. And how ro rocking are those biscuits? Really? Yeah. So Very great. light, tender. Mm. Yeah. You know how to do it, man. Yeah. I so appreciate it. <laughs>
I'm all ready to like have people over and let's make breakfast. Thomas breakfast. Keller. Thank you. As a, what a pleasure. Yeah.